Hey everybody, I'm Tony Rouser with ESP Guitars. We are at Hellfest 2022 here in Clisson, France. And I'm with my buddy Ben Wyman from hey. Suicidal Tendencies. Ben, how are you doing? I'm good, good to see you. It is quite hot here today, and we've been talking about that with everybody, but it just hasn't stopped. So. Moist. Quite moist. <laughs> Very hot and moist, but you know it does very well in these kind of temperatures. Oh yeah, what? Guitar with an Evertune. Oh, you got right to it, man. I love it. You're holding right there the Ben Weinman One LTD signature guitar for yourself. Yes, sir. Ben, tell me about this guitar. What do you like about this guitar? What makes it special? Well, you know, I wanted to make a guitar that worked for me live, and uh, and also something I'd be proud to bring in the studio and play different genres. Is different genres of music and also a guitar that other people who didn't necessarily play metal could use and really love and um, I feel very happy to know that other people had the same uh, needs as I have um, so simple things like moving the volume knobs out of the way so you can play hard and aggressively without turning them on and off while you play um, the Fishman pickups I think are really good uh, middle ground between like like an active pickup and something more passive it's Absolutely. like a really really it's like what people have been really looking for it for a long time i couldn't agree more. they nailed it yeah. um and you got the two different voicings too so that's right between two the different voicings um it's neck through which is great again yeah. more stability uh it's got the um locking tuners um and then it's got this Evertune, which is like, I think I'm one of the first guys to be using it, really. You were the first um, guy to be using it. And I just knew it was for me when I heard about it. It's, it, it's this, this technology is great. It's not mechanical, or it's not electronic. Exactly. Or it's yeah. not, you know, it's just all springs and... Yeah, tension. It ten yes. Yeah, it, tension it's, loaded. It's, it's very, very smart and... Uh, very consistent. But on my way home from our last tour um, from Spain, my guitars got lost. They didn't show up for a week. When I opened the case, took the guitar out, it was perfectly in tune. I don't Never know where turned. that thing went, you know? Yeah, so, so you know, it fits, fits my needs great. It's also semi-hollow. Yeah. Which a lot of people unique. are surprised. But the combination of, like, wood, a lot of real estate gets taken out of the guitar for the Evertune, mm -hmm. like all this steel, all this metal. Yeah. So, but for some reason, the combination of the wood, metal, and then hollow body together makes a very, very unique awesome tone absolutely it's like a really good combination of air and different materials absolutely. Um, so yeah that's that's what I like about it that's what other people like about it very happy SP really nailed it yeah that Evertune bridge I always talk about you were the first person to bring that to us many years ago almost probably like nine or ten years now mm -hmm. this guitar has been a very successful great seller hasn't changed really just mm -hmm. You know, you were ahead of the game with the design at the time, and it's funny to see, that, you know, uh, the different kind of guitar trends that you know take some time to uh, yeah. take effect. But the Evertune, you know, it's something that we started doing with you, and now it's grown into a, just a huge series of guitars. People love them. Good. A lot of people can't play guitar without them or don't want to. Yeah. So it's it's very interesting to see that kind of progression of things. But and I remember you coming in and telling us the story of. Uh, did a festival maybe in like Alabama or something. You mm -hmm. left it on the stage, side stage in the sun all day. Yeah. And then you went and played the show that night and picked it up and it was perfectly in tune. So right. last night I had a borrow guitar because I didn't have my guitars and I didn't have an Evertune. Wow. Oh. And I'm not even used to having even a tuner on stage. So yeah. uh, I went out in the crowd to like climb on the kids and all this stuff. And of course they're grabbing the, the guitar and all this stuff. And I get back on stage, and it's completely out of tune. And I'm like, oh my god, I'm not used to that. Yeah. How's it playing in Suicidal Tendencies? It's kind of a dream come true. You know, I have these moments where, as a jaded old guy, I have to stop and say, if I was 16, how would I feel right now, you know? Yeah. It could be anything, like hanging out with Metallica, or playing these festivals, or being in Suicidal Tendencies. It's those things I take for granted. I'm starting to try to really appreciate it. I remember sitting outside of my friend's house he had a half pipe in his backyard mm -hmm. and i skated and i didn't really know much metal but these older kids were listening to suicidal tendencies uh in skating and, and you know and mike muir the singer his his brother's one of the original z boys he was yeah. a pioneer in skateboarding so the skaters always listen to suicidal so i started listening to it and i remember literally flipping that tape in my walkman back and forth so much that it started to wobble because the tape is actually yeah. getting worn down. Yeah, really wearing it out. And being like, these solos, wow, this is crazy. So 
I was a really big fan. It was a transitional band for me to get into heavy music and guitar. So when Mike called me, it was um, pretty cool. It's a pretty cool thing. And so I'm playing music I love and something I'm passionate about. So I'm happy. It's very cool, man. It's a dream gig for sure. And uh, Ben, thank you so much for taking the time to talk to us for a couple of minutes. Very excited to see you play tonight and to see you playing that guitar. And uh, Me yeah, too. Man. Excited to play it. <laughs> Thanks, dude. All right, ESP Guitars from Hellfest 2022. Thank you very much. Dr. Regan, watch up the dot. I'm going to shit you. Get it right. The right in heaven. Made the clock. The two things. The two shots. I'm a demo.